Second race then at Happy Valley. Class five again for race number two. We get up to the 1650 though here for the second. Again, 12 going to post, headed by Off The Reel, who was due to run last week over 1800 metres, but 1650 this time round. Viva Popcorn, uh, fourth over the 1800 metres behind Mr. Monty at Chartin last time out. Go Ballistic also was in that 1800 metres uh, last week. Diamond Star was as well. Happy Jai Jai, third up for the season. Run up course and distance beyond on XL Star last time out. Super Kin. Sort of runs a good race, runs a bad race. He was behind uh, on Excel Star himself last time out. Wealthy employee also was uh, due to run in the 1800 meter contest last week. We get down through speed, force, and many gains. Who was uh, down the field also in the Onyx Star race, beaten four and three quarter lengths mark. Good to slow the tempo for this 1650 race with Shanghai Grace getting a sole lead over Super Kin. Got him going forward this week, but he has been up and back like a yo yo off the reel. Bonda Star, Sun Sun, far, far out there, three wide. Go ballistic, many gains. And we go back through the field to Speed Force, Diamond Star, and Wealthy Employee getting a much more economical trip than last time. Right, well, we'll start off here with some um, shot in form, in actual fact, Paul. Viva Popcorn, who stayed on really strongly from the back to uh, be a fast finishing fourth. Diamond Star ran fifth. Yeah, look, he's done this a couple of times now. The, the previous start behind Victorious Leader at Chartin was pretty similar. Uh, look, he'll want to get into the race early. He's changed a jockey now. Zach uh, Burton will jump aboard. Uh, Viva Popcorn. The horse is definitely in form, so he he's definitely goes in for me. Yeah, found a spot for him too. He's coming back from the 1800 to the 1650, and he comes to Happy Valley for the third time. But he's found a home in Class 5 at the moment. He can build some confidence up, and he'll go fairly close. It's an interesting as well whether the drop back in trip will suit some of these. Go Ballistic we can have a look at uh, next winning. Now he was due, Marks has said before, to run over 1800 metres last time but they have to now take the, the 1650 option. They do. He was placed at the trip two starts ago behind Shaw Win-Win so it shouldn't be an issue for him. He carries an extra six pounds for that uh, first start win. That was the first win in Hong Kong for Luke Ferraris. David well represented amongst the top four here, Paul. But I thought he could go a reasonably good race again. He was strong at the finish there, Go Ballistic, so he's in the top four. Yeah, look, I, I put him in on a minor line. It, it took him 27 starts to win that race, but uh, he won it nicely enough. Mm. I don't think it's a positive coming back in trip for wealthy employee, though. Um, happy Jai Jai we can have a look at as well. Second here with Manny Gaines and Super Kin, one of his off nights this time, Paul. Yeah, look, I thought um, Happy Jai Jai seems to be improving this horse. He's now uh, with um, Benno Young, and uh, I think Benno's got the horse going quite nicely at the moment. So I've included of this lot, I've included Happy Jai Jai. I thought he might be hard to beat here. He's beaten on his merits by Onyx Hill Star, who was rated beautifully in front by Chad, but he's held on well. He showed good improvement between his first two starts when he stepped up in trip and stays at the 1650 again. Mm. The first race was open. Uh, this one on paper looks similar, Paul, or is it? Have you got one clear cut? No, I haven't. I, th I think it's a real open race. I'm going around the top of the handicap, though, uh, with uh, a horse called Off the Reel. He, he goes on top. This will be his second start at 1650. He's another one that was down to race over 1800. But from barrier five, I think he can be right on the pace and maybe get first run over Viva Popcorn. A uh, happy Jai Jai is on the improvement. Go Ballistic on, on the back of his um, last win over 18, well, his only win over 1800. 1263. Happy Jai Jai has the same barrier as that second behind on XL Star. Barrier number seven, likely to work forward again. And uh, Keith Young rides for Benno Young. So six on top to beat number two, Viva Popcorn. He's going to be really hard to beat if his last two runs are anything to go by. He's coming back in trip. Three go ballistic, last start winner. He's back in trip two and through the nine in wealthy employee simply because he's got a better draw. He raced wide over the 1800 last time. The further they go, the better he's going to look, but he might be able to sneak into fourth late. We've all got the two and three in our numbers. The other numbers uh, for me are one and eight. But go ballistic, despite the drop in trip, might be too good again. That's uh, race number two, class five over the 1650.